everyone and welcome to Hoopla Kids How To. Today I am going to show you how to make something really, really awesome and that is how to make Play-Doh with crayons. What? That's right, Play-Doh with crayons. So for this we are going to need some wax crayons. You're also going to need 125 mils of water, 125 grams of plain flour, 60 grams of salt, one tablespoon of cream of tartar and a drop of cooking oil. So let's get started. First up we're going to mix all our dry ingredients into a bowl. Perfect. Give that a good mix. Set that aside. Now we want to take the paper off one of our crayons. And we're going to break it up into little pieces. Let's head to the hob. We're going to add a dash of oil and the bits of our crayon to a saucepan. Because it's wax, the crayon is going to melt, creating an awesome bright yellow colour in this case. Make sure the entire crayon is melted. Add the rest of the water and give it a good mix. Don't worry if it doesn't mix straight away, just keep stirring. Once everything's melted, we're going to add the dry mixture. Give it a good stir. If the mixture isn't starting to lump together, add a little bit more water and a dash more oil. This will be done after about two minutes, so take it off the hob. It's important that you let this sit. But once it's cooled, that's it. Play-Doh made from a crayon. Isn't that awesome? This yellow is great. What an awesome color. That's the great thing about making crayon Play-Doh. The colors are so vivid. You can make any different color you like. Here I am cooking up a red crayon. This is gonna make some awesome red Play-Doh. The great thing about this mixture is that the dye won't dye your hands like it sometimes does with traditional Play-Doh and food dye. Isn't that awesome? This feels so squidgy and awesome. Wow, here is blue. Looking good, guys. What other colors can we make? You can make the entire set of crayons. That is loads of colors. Do you like playing with Play-Doh? I do, it's super fun. Here we've got primary colours, red, yellow and blue. If you don't want to use up all your crayons to make different colours, why don't you try mixing the Play-Doh itself? We all know that blue and yellow makes green. So here I am making some green Play-Doh. This is a cool way of doing it if you don't want to go back to the hob and make a whole nother batch. I love this green. Super cool. Let's add red and yellow to make orange. 
This is a great orange. Perfect. Finally, let's make some purple with blue and red. These are such great colors. That's what happens when you make crayon Play-Doh. Well done guys, we've made a mini rainbow. Don't they look great? Super fun! And what an easy way of getting amazing colors. What colors are you going to make? Great work! Crayon Play-Doh, here on Hoopla Kids How To. Today I'm going to show you how to do a DIY bendy pencil. That's right, they're pencils and they're bendy. So for this you're going to need some pencils, some bacon bend clay, a craft knife, a cocktail stick, a wooden skewer and a pencil sharpener. So let's get started. First up we're going to take our pencil. I'm using my craft knife to cut into the end. We want to snap off the eraser. Perfect. Now we want to remove the wood from the pencil. This is quite tricky, but remember, practice makes perfect. We want to be left with the exposed lead. Nearly there. Now let's take our clay. I'm rolling it into a long, thin spaghetti shape. I'm taking my skewer and I'm pressing it into the middle. We want to wrap the clay around the skewer, just like so. Perfect. That looks great. Now we're going back to our pencil lead. I'm using my craft knife to get some shavings off it. Now I'm taking some more clay and I'm mixing it with the shavings we have from the pencil lead. This is going to become our bendy pencil inside. Let's go back to our original pencil that we've made from the clay. We want to pull out the skewer. See how bendy it is? Now we're going to take our lead clay. We want to fill the space where the skewer was, so roll a long thin spaghetti shape and push it on the inside. Use your skewer to push it down the other end. Keep feeding it through. Great! Now I'm taking a pencil sharpener. I'm sharpening the end, and then that's it. There you have it, a bendy pencil. Look how much it can bend. You can make any different colors and different patterns as well. Wow, super cool. Don't they look great? These are so much fun. How cool. And there you have it, your very own DIY bendy pencil. Thanks for watching Hoopla Kids How To. See you again soon. Bye.